The demolition of a former camp for Armenia orphans has been halted due to public protests with activists preparing to spend the night at the site to prevent further attempts to demolish the building. Around 10 o'clock a.m. on Wednesday, bulldozers entered Camp Armin a former summer camp for Armenian orphans in the Tuzla district of Stanbul to demolish the building in order to build luxury residences in its place. According to a news report from the Armenian weekly newspaper Agos, the construction machines have already demolished five bedrooms, the camp director's room, the chapel, and some of the surrounding fences. When people heard of the demolition, politicians including People's Democratic Party, HDP, parliamentary deputy candidates Sezen Okar, Best Kaplan, and Garo Palin, of Armenian descent and activists from the Nor Zartonk Initiative as well as former resident of the camp, Garabet Aranaz, attended at the site to oppose the destruction. Palin posted on Twitter, construction equipment is waiting in its corner. We call for people to keep watch until the return of land that has been usurped by the government. Number Camp Armenikamas Don Tidamala Camp Armandot. The camp was opened by the Gadakpasa Armenian Protestant Church Foundation in 1963 and was built in part by the orphans who were at the camp. A high court ruling issued in 1974 stated that minority foundations cannot own property. In 1983, the camp was closed and the deed to the land was returned to its former owner, despite legal action taken by the Gadakpasa Armenian Protestant Church, which owned and operated the camp, to prevent its closure. Ownership of the land has since changed hands several times. The camp has made attempts to regain legal title to the property but have been unsuccessful as have lawsuits filed seeking compensation. Earlier this month, Activists visited the location and tended to the abandoned building and garden. They have continuously been working to find ways to save the historically significant location and now speak of occupying the site as they see no other remaining options. The camp's most famous resident, who was later a camp counselor, was Turkish-Armenian journalist Hrant Dink, who was assassinated in 2007. Turkish Armenians are a minority population in Turkey estimated to be some 50,000 to 80,000 citizens. The population of Armenians living in the Turkish Republic dropped drastically after the expulsion and massacre of Armenians in 1915 as the Ottoman Empire collapsed. These killings have been labeled genocide by many Western countries and international organizations. Armenians who have continued to live in Turkey have been subjected to widespread discrimination, which Dink battled in part through his role as editor-in-chief of the Turkish-Armenian weekly newspaper, Agos.